Hi all, this is Tim Olson with Evolution Software. In today's video, we're going to demonstrate how to convert an OBJ file into a SAT, STEP, or IGIS file. Let's go ahead and first and see what file we are converting in terms of the number of facets by going to a mesh analysis. Here we can see the, the makeup of the file consists of 1,190 quads. This tool will convert triangles and quads. Next we'll go to our power pack tool for converting subdivision meshes to nerves. And we'll just uh, simply select our mesh and have it cart start converting. Since this collection of facets was closed, we uh, got a closed solid. And we can go ahead and select the uh, resulting solid and perform uh, solid mounting operations. Or we can go ahead and calculate mass properties from it. Let's calculate quick mass properties. And let's assign it with the, with the plastic. And here you can see we can get our volume, a weight, density, moments of inertia associated with this solid. And uh, we can see by selecting on it and going to the verify check object, uh, the number of faces that were converted. And we can see that it created 288 faces. So it uh, merged and smoothed over 1,190 quads into 288 nerve faces and then stitch them together into a solid. Let's go ahead and, and export it now. And the first one we'll do is an IGIS. We'll just use all the standard defaults. And we'll save it into our skull folder. We'll call it skull IGIS. Likewise, we'll go ahead now and we will export as a SAT file. We'll do an ASUS R23. And we'll save that. And then lastly, we will export out as a step file. Our next step then is to read this into uh, another third party application and see how well our surfaces uh, come across. And for this part of the demo, I'm going to switch over into an evaluation unit of Rhino on the Mac. And we will open up that file we just created. And we're going to open up our the step uh, version of it. And we'll just uh, use all the default options. And then what we will do is uh, let's go ahead and do a service analysis. And we'll do a zebra and we'll select this model and then let's zoom up and you can see that uh, those original 1100 facets have been merged into uh, very smooth nerve surfaces and then that continuity has moved across into the third-party app 